Hi guys, it's uh, 10 past 5 on a Sunday night and uh, I'm going to do something called um, Kao Bao Zi which means um, roast pies or samosas anyway it's, um, it's a little um, lamb um, pie that's baked inside a tandoor um, in western China, Xinjiang anyway um, it's cooked by the Muslims, the uh, Uyghurs. So I'm going to get this up to um, temperature, and then I'm going to bake them on the floor of the um, uh, chimney once it's up to temperature. And I've also got my little uh, spark arrester screen, which I re rescued from my old um, fireplace. It's like a sort of chain mail thing. Anyway, um, so what is it? I said uh, nine past five, and uh, probably take an hour to get the thing up to speed. So let's go. We're about an hour into the um, burn now, and I've added um, a bit more um, wood to the fire. It's taken a while to get the fire going because I think my kindling and my wood is a bit uh, damp. And of course everything's cold. I've got a uh, new cast iron skillet uh, which I'm going to heat up on top of the uh, chimney here. And also heating up bits of um, more wood for the fire. The wood's just all damp. Anyway, um, shouldn't be too long before the um, granite is ready for cooking. And um, I think this is all the wood that I'll be putting onto the fire. And once these is down to coals, then I'll um, I'll be um, cooking. I hope. Ooh, that's sort of um, without sparkly. Explosions from this uh, mecha carpa. <sighs> My skillet. I better check the image on that. So the skillet says uh, 270 Celsius, which is probably where I about to want it. Anyway, I'm um, just going to hang on a bit longer and wait for all that um, wood to reduce so I can get into the um, chimney. Well, we're pretty much down to coals now, so let's just shift this wood aside. Come on, move. Oops, not what I wanted. A coal that popped out. All right, let's shift you beggars away to the sides. You can burn over there. I think this would be good for pizza, but I'm not doing pizza. Come on. Out of. Out of the way. Actually, I wonder if I could. Um, I wonder if I could take some of those coals and put them into. Hmm. Right, let's get a temperature gun and see what it's showing. It says 500 in the middle, 346, 530. Good for pizza, I guess. What's my uh, 
my pan doing? 147. Okay, I think I'm going to cool my pan down a bit. Actually, let me just check. They say you can chuck a handful of flour on the um, on your pizza stone or whatever and see what happens to it. Oops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and it's burning. So, way too hot. <laughs> but it didn't burst into flame. I thought it might do. Anyway, let's shift that out. Now I'm just going to get my um, griddle a little bit hotter. This chain is proving to be a bit problematic. All right, let's leave that there. I want that about 300 if I can. It should steal some heat from the pizza stone. Or the granite stone rather. I think I need to wait a bit longer. Steal more heat. Two thirty six. Perhaps it's stolen enough. Keep it longer. All right. Three forty-three. All right, let's give it a go. <clears throat> Let me just take that off. Okay, now. Yeah, she did again. Now it's all eating. We are we only put this uh pit uh bowls in the middle. Uh, meat. Yeah, each year, okay. Just meat. Ah, okay. Just each year. Okay. Okay, talk. I understand. Okay. Hmm. Middle. Each year. Just put three, okay? Three. Okay. 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 I don't know if it's going to be hot enough. <laughs> All right, put a few coals on top of the um, griddle. <coughs> um, how many minutes? I hope we don't burn this. It's 
Let's have a peek under, underneath. Okay. So cooking, baking a pie in the oven, normally you form the crust on the outside and then it proceeds to cook on the inside. Whereas um, cooking on a um, pizza stone or um, a heated um, granite stone cooks on the inside out. So the last thing that happens is that the crust forms on the outside. I think I need more coals on this. Should use charcoal. So about two minutes now, I think. Peek, peek a bird. Ah, uh, it's burning underneath. Oh well, I guess we will just have to. I don't know what we're going to do. Doesn't heat up. So three minutes now. Let me need uh need you to see I'm in yeah, we didn't hear you, she was saying. Huh? Much, much better if we had coals. Briquettes or something. A lot of heat. Huh? <coughs> huh? Yeah, but it's not browning on top. It's not browning on top. Up. I wonder if I can start more fire. Can you hold this? And I'll just put some more some wooden. Good idea.
glasses. <clears throat> it's the most efficient way of doing things. Okay, good. Okay. Okay. Getting there. It's browning a bit. So the trick is we need a fire going as well. What? Normally you do this with um, charcoal briquettes or something, I think. I don't know. Probably we can't shift it, the um, buns around. Actually, I guess we could. <coughs> I use this technique in um, Dutch oven cooking. My legs are going numb. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Just going to shut these coals off. Oh, have you got a plate? You got a plate to put the burn buns in. My um, spatula, the uh, yeah. I'm going to do it. Go, 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 go,
哎呀，太糊了！哇，这是这个。So that's the end result of our Carl Balza. A little bit dark and um, looks like the base is a bit overdone. Yeah, a little bit. Anyway, the test is in the eating, they say. That's better. Is it cooked? Let's have a look. Show the bread. It looks okay. A little bit uh, toasty. So the top looks pretty good. So the plan is to, I think next time is to not get the, uh, let this stone cool down a bit. Maybe cover it with the, um, the griddle. And um, when it's cooled down, then do the cooking and then start the fire again on the outside. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. Oh. Yeah, Xinjiang Kalbalzi.